Hello, this is Brother, and welcome back to another episode of our Let's Play for Farming Simulator 22 as we continue our Start from Scratch Elm Creek run here. And it has been far too long since I've been doing some farming simulator content. Actually, any content of any kind. My, my entire channel <laughs> went on sabbatical and didn't tell me. No, I'm just kidding. Um, I, I, I just got really busy over the summer. Um, I tried to trim back on how many videos I were putting up. I thought, okay, maybe I just need to do less videos. And even that I couldn't really stick to. Uh, there's too many things going on. Um, I mean, I had jury duty, for example. That was fun. Uh, <laughs> 10 of 10 do rec- No, I'm just kidding. I don't recommend. That was- I get that it's our civic duty, you know, but it, it wasn't as bad as maybe I thought it would be, but it was still disruptive. I mean, I had to be out for a few days, um, away from work and things like that. Couldn't talk about it, you know, whatever was going on with my family. Um, thankfully it was just a civil- c c Civic- Civil- Civil trial. There we go. I was like, the word. <laughs> not, it was not a criminal trial. Um, I heard I heard tell that the same judge the very next week was starting a criminal trial that was going to take like several weeks. Several weeks of at least, if not more. Um, and that would not have been fun. So thankfully, it was only a few days of that week that I had to be out. But still, you know, disruptive and, you know, one of those things. But uh, also, you know, had to go out of town for about a week. Um, and just other stuff going on just life and and craziness and but now kids are back in school and things are getting back to a little bit more of a semblance of normality so i think i'll be able to get back into the swing of consistent youtube videos or at least that's the that's the hope and dream but if you're still here if you have watched this entire time and waited for me to put up more content then i really really appreciate you sticking around if you are relatively new to the channel and didn't even notice the blip because you just started watching the series and it's this this next video was up by the time you got to it then uh well welcome to the channel and uh yeah glad the 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 absence didn't didn't affect you too badly if at all but uh definitely definitely wanted to keep doing youtube stuff i enjoy it um i do do have fun with I was actually make sure that guy was about to wipe out on that uh telephone pole um i, I definitely enjoy uh doing the content i was missing it up for for a bit there there's actually some new uh a new uh, dlc for farming simulator coming out here in a couple days so uh i'll do a couple videos i'll probably record a few videos for this so you guys probably won't see that new content on this series until maybe next week but uh maybe some of the other series might get it sooner i'm not sure it depends on when i can sit down and record i have still have three series going i have this series the swiss series and the tribute run series i did stop the french orchards run i, I just it was fine, but I just wouldn't have as much fun with that one as I uh, have with some of the other ones. So I figured, why not? If we're going to cut anything out, that's the one that seems to make the most sense to cut out. And so there we go. Uh, we're finishing up planting some grass here as I'm trying to remember exactly where we left off. I should have gone and watched the last video that I recorded just so I can remember, but I kind of hit the record button and forgot. So I was like, whatever, we'll figure it out together. No big deal. Uh, but we are getting this stuff rolled out. And we're getting the grass planted. I do think we still need to plant the barley, according to my little flow chart of... Okay, not flow chart, but it's like I have all the months laid out for all my different series. And then I have what I'm supposed to do for each one, just so I can keep track of each series and what each one's doing. Uh, that's not what I wanted. I want to keep you going, my friend. I want to skip over to you and cancel your run. In fact, what we'll do is we'll just come over here and clean up this little mess that you made while I'm letting that other guy get turned around. So what are we doing with this series? I mean, obviously we're 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 trying to work our way up to cakes, and we've talked about that a bit. It's a lot of work to get up to cakes. There, there's there's a lot of a lot of moving parts, a lot of stuff going on with that. I had discussed uh, discussed um, you know not doing everything on this particular series because I've done a lot of it on the other ones, like cows and things like that. I'm not sure. I'm still having fun with it, so I may just just get it going. You know, see how big of a farm we can do. Like you need a massive amount of stuff going on to do cakes, which is pretty crazy to think about. Um, cows are not small, you know. Um, obviously, you need chickens, so you need you need eggs coming out. You need... Uh, we got the strawberries going already. Uh, we've got the flour. We've got a way to get flour. This thing does not turn very well. 
Um, what else do we need for cake? Strawberries, cho uh, strawberries, flour, eggs, milk. Why do I think there was one more ingredient? We can look real quick. Sugar. Oh, yes, sugar. I d just started making sugar on my Swiss chocolate run recently, uh, which is allowing us to make finally make chocolate for the first time. Um, and so, yeah, sugar is definitely going to be an interesting one as well, because we're obviously doing sugar over there as well as cows. So two of the things you need for cakes we're actually already doing on our other save. All right, let's get you flipped over to um, barley. I think we're still doing barley. That is the most efficient for chickens, if I'm remembering correctly. And uh, we definitely want to work our way up to chickens eventually. Maybe easier said than done, but we're going to get there at some point. Uh, strawberries are looking okay. Silage, we're definitely holed up on silage. Silage we can't sell till January though, but we're close. We're close to the time period we can sell the silage. Uh, we've got what, we're probably gonna have close to 400,000 silage, right? If we start pulling that out of there, we'll get a little bit more being produced. So we'll have close to 400,000 all said and done. And at the price for silage, at a good price for silage, what does that put come out to? How much money we got sitting there? We just sit it at three hundred thousand. It's about let's say three hundred thousand, and we say well, somehow we got two hundred bucks for it. That is sixty thousand bucks. Is that right? So it's three hundred times two hundred. Yeah, sixty thousand bucks. So not too bad. Not too bad. Trippy till we'll have more grass going into it before we probably could sell stuff anyway. Uh, we got mill grass here in November. March and May. I think those are the three cycles that we're going to be mowing grass on. I might need to do some more... something. I mean, we're doing sorghum still on these fields. Still feel like we're a little bit short of what we need for chickens, but we'll, we'll figure out how to make it work. I like how I want to automate this. The guy runs the mowers, too. <laughs> it's like, okay. I guess that's just how he does it. Uh, at least he's able to do it. It's convenient. Really would like to get this field 50 here at some point. I think that would really help our total yields out quite a bit. I think there's a little bit over here. He missed so we'll get that clump trimmed up mostly because we got nothing else to do anyway while we're waiting on that other guy to get a little bit more further advanced with the cedar someday i'll get a nice cedar and uh be able to speed this process up a bit this poor uh poor tractor's gonna need some gas soon As well as repairs. Actually, I was looking at the repairs first, so no. <laughs> it will need gas soon. Don't get me wrong. It's, it's halfway. But I was looking at the wrong thing. Uh, repairs is what it needs first. Have we repaired this thing since we bought it? I'm sure we have, right? Oh, uh, the cedar is so slow. Mostly, I mean, I say mostly. Entirely because it's so small. There's just really nothing else that we can get with the current rates that we have. What did we buy most recently? I actually don't remember. Why, like, why are we poor right now? Let's see here. We spent money on a new vehicle in June. What did we buy in June? I don't remember. 21,000 bucks. The Speedmax 560? What is the Speedmax 560? Let's see here. Let's go here. Oh, yeah. Okay. All right. Fair enough. We need that. Mulcher. I mean, I said we need it. I mean, it's 
But obviously can, can buy without it if we wanted to. But it does help our overall yields a bit. And I'm sure it'll pay for its 21,000 bucks pretty quickly with those slightly increased yields. Obviously, we've got the nice trailer over here. We got a decent amount of bread sitting here waiting. Um, another one over there. We might have another one by the time we sell it. So how much bread is that? Uh, each of these is what? 1,000 liters? 20, 20,000 liters, 21,000 liters. And how much does bread sell for right now? It has been too long since I looked at these numbers. Oh, I missed the wrong direction. So we're going to get what? 35,000 bucks? Apologies for the odds. Um, right? About 1700 bucks a piece, um, times two would be 3400 bucks. Well, times 20 would be 34,000 bucks, so maybe 35,000 bucks, something like that. It's not a ton of money, to be fair, but it will help. What is oh, I've never seen that before. Just a stick in the middle of nowhere, can't pick it up or anything. Kind of random. Strawberries are looking okay. We got a ton of strawberries, like a ton of strawberries over here. So we have money. We have money waiting, just not time yet. Do I have? Oh, there it is, January. Sell strawberries at the same time as we sell silage. So we will be getting that soon-ish. All right, well, let me let this thing run for a little bit. And then I will return and uh, we'll get the rolling done as well. All right, I'm back. I have finished the seeding of the barley. Now, just rolling out the barley at the moment. Um, I do need to check because we need to remove or get rid of this thing here. Did I empty it out yet? Um, it looks empty. I think it's empty. Oh, I guess I could see it from the outside. Uh, I guess it would tell me if there was something in it. Okay, so we're good. We can go ahead and return you, I think. I don't think there's anything else I need with you. Shoot. Let's return you. And let's get in you and turn you off. Get this finished up, and then we're good to go. Um, next month will be herbing and herbicide and fertilizing of the barley. Uh, we won't need to herbicide the grass, but... Do we fertilize the grass? I suddenly don't remember if we fertilize the grass. Why do I not remember that? Shows you how long it's been since I've actually sat down and played this game. Uh, no, fertilization is good on the grass. So I thought it was, but I couldn't remember. So yeah, just, just the barley, and then that's it for the month of October. Come November, we mow grass, so that's what we get to look forward to then. And then finally, we get to sell some, some stuff in December. That'll be good. We'll be able to finish this in one pass. I don't... Uh, probably if we move you over. Let's just take over here. I can drive straight. <laughs> Steering on this thing is so weird. Come on. Steer somewhat straight, my friend. Good enough. We'll get it done.
slid a little bit there. All right, there we go. Rolling is done. We can move on with our our month, I guess, to the next month. All right, so we are done. Let's let's just get out and move on to the next month. I don't think there's anything else for us to do today. So let's get going. All right, let's get the herbicide and fertilizer ready to go. This is the fertilizer. I don't think it's going to use very much fertilizer. It looks like it's, looks like it's mostly good to go. For whatever reason, that needed a lot more. At least this month will go quick with just the herbing and fertilizing. 
of the one field. We don't have to do anything else. I didn't need much at the far end, but this close end, it actually did need quite a bit, which is which is fine. It's good that we did it. All right, so that's the fertilizer. Let's go pick up our herbicide now. It's nice having the cameras on this thing, just so it doesn't do the full herb herb uh, herbiciding. Just like the John Deere does it targeted. So I think the DLC that's coming up here in a couple days is just a bunch of like bailing stuff if I looked at it right. So like auto, there's like a self-propelled baler and things like that. That's, you know, kind of cool actually. i um, not sure how relevant it'll be for a lot of our stuff that we're doing at this point because we've moved on to kind of more bulk operations for pretty much all of our, all of our stuff that we do. So, but I mean, in the future, I think it's pretty cool. Uh, it really depends how much the, uh, self propelled thing costs. I mean, if it costs a stupid amount of money, it may it may not be worth it, you know? Although, bailers, bailers in general are actually pretty expensive. So, I mean, it could still be pretty expensive and still be more worth it than, you know, a lot of the bailers that are out there.
All right, well, I'm going to go ahead and put a cut in there. When we come back, I will have, obviously, the weeding finished up. I will be ready to fast forward to November where we're going to be mowing some grass. But I do appreciate you guys watching. May God bless you, and I hope you join me again next time. Thank you, and goodbye. I wanted to give a special shout-out to the following channel members. Thank you so much for supporting the channel.